Okay, so this is about Billy, who's actually called Mark. <laughs> I was young, used to watch TV. I used to like Pink Goon. I used to sit from mouth up the wide on the set, eat and watch cartoons. One more try, maybe leave a dip on it. Maybe go and make friends outside. That was crap at that. Didn't even have an imaginary friend. That's rubbish! Yeah, it was. And I used to look at girls. And I used to imagine what it would be like to be in a girl's room, watching TV on their bed. Then I grew and I did it and I found out it was nice so I tried to do it more and more Then I met a boy next door called Billy, you live next door Billy Billy, I love you Billy Billy, yes, true. I love you Billy, I really love you I didn't really love Billy but I did He was my best friend I'd bike over in the evening, we'd sit around in his room and then the bike all game again Try not to get beat about the kids inside the post office and the corner shop I used to bike with no lights at night, I was really dangerous. Billy Billy are blue. Billy Billy, yeah, it's true. Ah! Put some lights on! Now I'm really mad. Yeah, look, Billy is my best friend. We used to watch late night TV together. Then one day Billy got shingles, which he didn't really like. He said to his mum, but not to me. I get to watch late night television all the time. Then one night watching, what was watching? Uh, Naked lady with a motorbike. Channel 5. Confessions of a window cleaner. Walking down the street thinking, oh, I can't have fucking Because the thing is, he wasn't a hack process. And it fucks up. See, when I was a child, he used to watch the confessions of a window cleaner. Didn't you see that? Did you see that? Now you get a hack process walking down the street thinking, oh, I can't have sex with him. And in the Nicky Van Lessons, we shed the bed sort of. I didn't know what it meant to be close to another human being. So I think he actually might have been in love with Billy Abstrange. Billy Billy, I'll be you. Billy Billy, yes, yeah, true. Billy Billy, I love you. And now you're happily married.